Good morning and welcome back. Starting a new year's full of resolutions and one change could be the start of a new career path. So Maureen Bartelt, managing broker and forever agent with Berkshire, Berkshire Hathaway Home Services Premier Properties is here to share why a career in real estate could be one of your resolutions in the new year. Good morning, Maureen. Hi there. Thank you for joining us today. Yes, I'm happy to be back. Yeah, absolutely. So why should someone consider a career in real estate? Well, you know, real estate can be a life-changing career. I mean, obviously, I'm going to say that because I'm in real estate. <laughs> but for a self-motivated individual, um, it, it can be great, especially from the aspect of owning your own time. Mm -hmm. It's not your traditional Monday through Friday career. And agents would tell you that means that we're working a lot. It's not just, you know, an hour here and an hour there. Yeah. But they love that. They love the ability to control their own time. On top of that, we get to be part of some of people's biggest life events. And whether those are happy or sad, the relationships we create with our clients are not just transactional. Um, we get to be part of the American dream of home ownership, and that's, that's really, really exciting. So it can be a transformational career um, for anybody who's blessed to be involved in it. Yeah, absolutely. It sounds like a lot of independent work that you guys absolutely. do, um, along with helping someone get into their homes. I bet the, that reaction of just like seeing their first home buyer getting their first it's, home. It's really special, and I mean, there, there are times when it's bittersweet, yeah. um, but we pride ourselves on being the professional that gets to guide them through that process from front to back. Yeah, so it's really absolutely. Special. And you're a huge part in that, making that happen. 100%. So I love that. So aside from the personal impacts that real estate can offer, tell us more how realtors have impacted people locally and nationally. Absolutely. Well, real estate agents, real estate agents, excuse me, realtors, there is actually a difference um, between a real estate agent and a realtor. Okay. A realtor is a member of the National Association of Realtors. And we are guided by our code of ethics, um, which in many states is more strict than the laws that govern us. Oh. So um, that that's a really big deal. And, and mm -hmm. I think the general public probably doesn't even realize that. Mm -hmm. So we are a very civic minded group. Um, the overwhelming majority of realtors participate in our election cycles. That's a, that's a big deal. Yeah. Um, outside of fighting for personal property rights, we also have huge impacts on many other industries. For example, at the height of the COVID-19 pandemic, when self-employed individuals were able to file for self-employment benefits, that was thanks in part to the efforts of the National Association of Realtors in Washington, oh, D.C. Okay, very Locally, um, we, we fight for com consumer protection. So one of the, the big things in the last few years that Realtors in North Dakota fought for was access for a consumer to have um, excuse me, access to a seller's property condition disclosure, whether an agent was involved in that transaction or not. And that is legislation that was passed. So that's a really big deal. Um, we live, work, and play in the communities we serve, and we, t we care a lot about taking good care of our neighbors. Yeah, absolutely. And give us some examples of how you guys are so involved <coughs> in the community, because you are there. We are there. Yeah. Um, Realtors as a group are very philanthropic, um, both from time, talent, and treasure. Mm -hmm. And so we, we're working on kind of a year-end event right now with our team. And, and the amount of responses that I got from my team when I asked them what organizations they volunteer with, I think our slide for that portion of our, of our event is about four pages long. So wow. um, they're just a very giving, involved group. Yeah, just dedicated. Yes. So say someone's chosen a career in real estate, uh, what sets working with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services Premier Properties apart from other brokerages? First and foremost, the power of the brand. Um, Berkshire Hathaway is one of the most widely known names in the world, and our agents get to reap the benefits of that brand recognition. That's really powerful. Um, the systems and marketing that we have are expertly done. Locally, we have a beautiful office located Right at the corner of the I-94, I-29 exchange, you've probably driven by and seen one of our agents on our digital board. And then our, our support staff in Fargo is second to none. Um, we really pride ourselves at Berkshire Hathaway on guiding our clients from start to finish through that buying and selling process with ease and simply put our Berkshire Hathaway family is, is the best. All right, lovely. I love that. So why would you want like you're not in Berkshire anymore or not anymore but you're not in Berkshire yet and you're looking into Berkshire why would you want to join you know we've got a great team 
that is made up of agents that are brand new and very experienced veteran agents. And one of the things we love is how those veteran agents just give back yeah. to, to the agents that are, that are newer and help teach them. And we all take pride in the Berkshire brand mm -hmm. and what that means for our team. And so we, we really do focus on training, but not just training from me, the broker. Our, our other agents are hands-on in that and we very much have kind of an open door policy with everybody. So our, our culture is is top notch. I love that. So independent work, but with a teamwork effort. 100%. I love that. So, well, thank you so much for telling us all about that. Um, how can we get in touch with you and your team? You can reach me by phone at 701-356-3600 or via email mb at bhhspreproperties.com. All right, lovely. Thank you so much, Maureen. Yes. Coming up on today's show, we'll get a look at Frisco, Texas, as far as they've made their way down to the NDSU Championship. Thank you.